Okay, simple chest of drawers. Now, in some of the other videos that we've shown you, we, sh we use tape. Uh, tape is not ideal for pads. It can ruin pads over time. Uh, so what we utilize is rubber bands. Not only can uh, the rubber bands hold better on the pad for the furniture, but they can also uh, save a lot of money when it comes to material cost. Saving a lot of tape. We can reuse bands for uh, probably years. Okay, so when you start with the pad, if you can see here, I don't know how well the camera zooms in, but if you see here how the lines run horizontal, and this style pad, that means it's longer this way. So basically we're going to do the long side this way so we can fold it around the piece. Pads are 72 inches by 80 inches, so 80 inches this way, 70 inches this way. It all depends on what piece that you're using. In this case, we've got our lines running horizontal. Uh, it covers the bottom of the piece, which is what you're looking for, and it covers the top. So we want the extra length, so that way when we fold the sides in, it will uh, cover the sides uh, adequately. Okay, so always keeping in mind how it's going to be dollied to the truck. We're going to go ahead and fold in the side. So we don't want this all bunched up or when we put our dolly under it, it it'll create a, a round effect and the piece will be moving back and forth. Everything that we do is made to make moving simpler. If we can dolly it, we dolly it. So we're gonna pull a little bit more pad this way. So that way we cover the complete side. We just make a nice crease here in the corner. Make sure our bottom's padded and covered. And then we just do a nice smooth edge right across here. We take our rubber band, which we have different sizes. This is the smallest size that we have. And then we do the same thing with the other side. Nice and tight, crisp corner. This is a one man project. You don't need two people to pad wrap. So this does a couple things for us. One, it protects the piece inside the house. It'll stay pad wrapped throughout the entire process. And while you're dollying it, it keeps the drawers from falling out. So it does, it's got a couple advantages to it. Not only that, but it, it lets the customer have peace of mind knowing that you're taking good care of their furniture. Simply take your dolly, make sure you're underneath the legs of the piece, slide it on in there, tilt the piece back. Now you transport it in and out of the house, through the doorways, up the ramp, one man, minimum effort, and that's the best way you can do it.